Varsity All Access, powered by Five Star Preps, sponsored by Ray Varner Ford and Clinton and Wendy's. Watching that piece with Nico, it's hard to believe we are one week away from Tennessee football. <laughs> I can't wait. But tonight it's all about high school football. Hi, everybody, and welcome to week two of Varsity All Access, powered by Five Star Preps. Rick Russo alongside my partner Paige Dower here in studio with you tonight. The heat causing several games to start a little later tonight, but some great action and special moments nonetheless, like out at Gibbs High School, Rick. Yeah, no doubt about it. The home opener for the Eagles against Halls High School, with the operative word being home. Coach Brad Turner's Eagles played all their games a season ago away from home while their stadium was being renovated. Well, the stadium is ready and doesn't it look great? And before kickoff tonight, the new friendly confines were dedicated with the Gibbs community out in force. Yes, Eagle Country ready to soar high and rightfully so. Also honored tonight, the seniors who didn't get to play at home last season. The Eagle statue there erected in their honor. Really cool stuff tonight. A total of 672 days since Jeez. the Eagles last played right on their home field and you bet they were excited coming out onto the turf tonight. Uh, not much doing early for the home team, but the Red Devils known for their run game had it going on. The nice carry by Marcus Moore down to about the Gibbs 15 yard line. That would bring an end to the first quarter and it didn't take the Red Devils long to cash in at the other end. Big Cameron Bates busts his way in for six. PAT good seven nothing. Ground game not working, so the Eagles try to soar through the air, and it works! Quarterback <laughs> Chase Norman unloads and connects with Hayden Mills down the sideline. Unfortunately, the Eagles would turn it over after that. Then late in the half, hey, yeah, trying to cool off out oh, there tonight yeah. too, yeah. Gives down 7-3, Coach Turner tries a little trickery, and it works too! The double pass ends up in the hands, watch this, of Boone Brockwell. <laughs> Eagles led 10-7 at the break, but the Eagles, my goodness, not much after that. The uh, visitors spoil the homecoming tonight. 24-13 is your final Red Devils. They're 2-0.